<laughs> hey YouTube, it's for Love Shy, aka Mer Bond, coming at you with a video. This is my lock curls and basket weave tutorial, hair tutorial. Okay, um, yeah. If you saw my previous video, you would have seen the style that was that was right so I just um, took down the basket weave and right now I'm gonna prepare the, my hair for curls and then I'll do the basket weave um, let me see all right what I did was I sectioned off my hair right for um, but when I started the I did the basket weave first then I didn't know what to do with the front so then I put them in curls so I'm going to do the reverse, I'll do the curls first, and then, like I said, put my hair in the basket weave. Alright, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to section my hair, um, front section, and just pin, pin it out of the way so I can curl them. Um, this is my left side, this is my right side. With my left side, alright, let me just say this, I love having... Uh, bangs to my right side so anything coming towards my right I love and you know having in the front to my right I love that so what I'm doing with my um, left side I'm crinkling them up making them kind of wavy curly and then what I do I bring them over and just pin them Pin them here, right in the middle, and then I have the my curls on my right side. So everything is just coming over to my right side. Maybe that's what I should do. Well, I'll just show you what I do. What um, I do for my left side curls. But that's basically what I do. I um, so after I take out the lock crinkles on my left side. I just bring them over, kind of twist them or fold them in some way and then stick a pin at the top and just let them blend into the, um, to my curls, my right side curls. But it's all about the right side with the curls, it's just all about them, right? So I'm sorry I'm not giving much love to my left side, mm -mm -mm. but for now I um. I just set them with my curl um, crinkles. So I just spray with my spray bottle, just water, lightly wet them. Because right now it's nighttime. I don't want them dripping wet. So I take at least maybe about six locks. Right here I got five. So I'm just gonna braid them together. Five locks, braid them together in plaits. Uh, yeah so that's what I'm doing and what I do after I finish braided yep you guessed it Bantu knot hey <laughs> uh, all right so I'm just gonna make this into a Bantu knot I'm, I think I'm is this counterclockwise or clockwise I can't tell Alright, that's my Bantu knot. Alright, do do do. And let me see how much I've got left. It's three. What's that here? Okay, number two. Okay. As you can see, I kind of talk to myself somewhat. Sometimes, sometimes. <clears throat> I'm just pinning this out of the way. All right, lightly wet it. Okay. Because when it dries, it's gonna dry um, whatever form it's in. So it will dry in the um, in the bantu knot. It'll dry in that form. So when I loosen it, 
when I let the hair out, it will be in like a curly, a curly state. All right, and Bantu knot. <coughs> okay, moving right along. This is only the left side, y'all. I'm only doing the left side in these, um, in these Bantu knots. Kind of weird doing my hair in like three different styles. Bantu knots, curls, and um, <laughs> basket weave. Mm. Well, it's the only hair. It's my hair. It's interesting hair. My locks. Okay. Alright, and I braided it. So now the band to not. Some people call them. Well, I think in uh, I think in the Jamaican uh, community they call it corkscrew, not corkscrew, uh, china bumps. So I've heard. All right. Um, let me see. I know them as corkscrews, but I learned them from YouTube as being called band to knots. So. Alright, these are my three uh, Bantu knots, and this side is my curls. So I'm going to start with the bottom here, bottom right. I'll just pin these out the way. And I noticed that it forms a different um, curl pattern with um, like having, I like these curls, the way these set, uh, what I used, what I used was my uh, flexi rods on my right side and as you can see what I did I, I braided my left side and put them in bantu knots so it had like a like a, a wavy crinkly pattern so I like the results from the from the flexi rods because the other day I had this hair, same hairstyle I just I um, for the front I had curls for the left side and the right side in plaits and bantu knots. So the right side was bantu knots. Everywhere in the front was bantu knots. And it was a wavy, crinkly type curl, but I love the results I get from these flexi rods. So, but um, I didn't want to put, um, all right, see this here? I'm gonna roll. I lightly missed it, uh, wet my hair, and then I'm gonna take the end of my locks and wrap them around the flexi rod. All right, and then roll them up in a not on, not rolling my locks on itself, like just staying in that position. It's gonna roll up the flexi rod. It's gonna roll up. So then when I take out my flexi rod, the, um, the locks would be kind of cascading, somewhat, so, alright, that's good to go. Okay, uh, what was I saying? I was talking something, something about the curls. Yeah, I like the way that these curls um, on the right side fell. Yep, that's pretty much that. Let's see. I had bought these curl uh, flexi rods. Um, I think I bought them when uh, yeah I bought them when I was uh, loose natural, and they came. These are the yellow ones, so they're not too big and not too small. So they have a nice curl to them. I bought them when I was a loose natural and they were 12 and a, I think 12 in a pack. So, all right, so with the flexi rods, I'm just curling, I'm going up the lock. You know what I want to try? Um, I just gotta buy them. I want to try the pipe cleaners. I want to try pipe cleaners on my locks. Um, I feel like 
if when my when my locks have more length to them, that these curls, these um, flexi rock curls would even would be even more banging. <laughs> they would be even more um, better, nice. I don't know the right verb, the um, right term. But they'll be better than what they are now. Like the the curl would last longer and. Um, yeah, it'll look so much nicer with that one. If, not if, when I get more length to my locks. That's what I think. But um, I've been seeing videos on the lock crinkles. Not lock crinkles, sorry. The um, pipe cleaners. Yeah, the pipe cleaners. So I'm like, I can't wait to get that. That would be so cool. I just need time to get them being lazy about it. I hope the beauty supply would have them. That would be nice. Save me a trip from finding the um, the yarn store. All right, I'm just continuing to curl these. Going up the, going up the flexi rod set. You know what? Like, I have time to do this, right? Because normally I would be watching TV if my shows were on. Everybody's on a winter break. So my shows are on a break. I love Vampire Diaries and um, the originals. If y'all watch the originals, you know what happened that season, that um, last season finale. I was pissed. I was mad. I yelled at the TV. I was like, OMG. So that's the originals. Can't wait for it to come back. Love that show. Love the uh, Vampire Diaries. Um, what else? Game of Thrones. GOT. Can't wait for that to come back. Um, I usually watch Scandal. They're losing me this season. They're losing me. Ugh. How to Get Away with Murder. Love my girl Viola Davis. And I will be watching How to Get Away with Murder. Season 2 wasn't that good in the beginning. But um, it's picking up. It's getting better. I'm sticking with it. Supporting Viola Davis show. I love her. And Grey's Anatomy. It's like this season is losing its flavor. Losing its je ne sais quoi. I don't know what that means, but it's losing its its essence, I guess. Alright. Um, so these are the curls. My flexi rods on my right side and the bantu knots on my left side. Now, time for the um, for the back. Yeah, like I said, this is the tutorial. So, um, look back at um, the previous video with the um, lock saw the lock sock and the set and bonnet review look at that video and see these results okay because <laughs> ah, I don't have that um, you know that technology to insert pictures in this current video for the results of this look so like I said go back to that previous video check out the hair that was there and you'll see exactly what this is gonna be looking like right okay work with my people Okay, <laughs> so for the basket weave, I'm going to be using bobby pins. Um, hopefully it works out, you know, basket weavy and everything. Let me turn around so you can see. All right, see, there I am. I see you, see me, see you, see me. 
Yeah. Okay. So let's begin. I'll start. Um, I'll just um, pick up here as I go. I'm starting from the bottom, <laughs> from my neck, I'm starting from there. I go from the last row. Just crossing over. So as I um, cross over, I'm picking up maybe one to two locks at a time. And um, what I did off camera, I lightly misted my locks with water so I'm just gonna weave this together in a nice basket so I'm just picking up hair as I go there's, I don't know if there's a right way to do this because I've done it a few times, but it never really, it never really held. I guess there is a right way. I just don't know which way that would would be. Um, well, what makes this easier, doing it this way? Um, I section off the front hair, so. The front hair is um, is in curls, so that means that everything in the back have, has to be in this in this basket weave, basically. So I know which hairs should be in this basket weave, right? So that saves me some time. So I just gotta make sure I grab them. Grab them all. Okay. Just coming over. Alright, these over here. And, um, I'm gonna weave until I can't weave no more. Speaking of weave, I've never had weave in my hair before. This is the only type of weave I've ever had. But in punch. <laughs> I'm trying to make jokes, but it's true. I've never had um, weave extensions in my hair. Only braids, wigs. That's about it. Faux locks. Well, that'll be that'll be my next video. Talk about faux locks. Faux locks is what's up. That's what's up. Okay, back to the basket weave. Now I've come to a point here at the top. That's where I'm gonna use my bobby pin. Pin pins. Bobby pins. So I'm just gonna. Stick them in, and hopefully they don't move or unravel. And try to use black ones so that it doesn't shine. Um, like if you wore to use white bobby pins, they'll definitely show through your hair. Or maybe if you use colorful pins, it would. Um, I don't know, it might look better, look good. But black is always. That's to go. Okay. All right, how's that looking? All right. Now I have um, something going on up top here. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to kind of make it like a little pompadour. 
fold it back. Okay, so I'll let you see from the front. All right. I'm not going to be heavy handed with it, I'm just going to be gentle by putting these. Bending it, forming it, wrapping it on itself. Let me see, I just need to find a place to tuck it in. Let's see if I can roll it. Just tuck in the ends. Mm -hmm. And on itself. And I'll get a bobby pin. Just tuck it in. Okay, I figure the more bobby pins, the better. Sometimes. So I'm just gonna stick the pin in. Alright, so all the hairs are, all the hairs are together. Alright, how's that looking? I'll just brush up the back. Alright. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> so I got my little, little pompadour going on. And you can see, let me see. All right, give you a little back view. All right, that's the back. I think it looks all right to me. And see at the top here? Let me bend down for you to see. On the top here, the space between the pompadour and my curls, I will, um, these, the left side will fill in that gap. So like these here, they will come over filling in that gap. So the curls will just, yeah, fill that out, work it out, work it out. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this lock tutorial, my lock curls and basket weave. Um, so this hairstyle is ready for bed. And I can't forget my satin bonnet. All right, so I'll just put it over. Start from the back and come to the front. This is loose. So not much elastic in the, in the band, but I still want to take a little off my um, little tension off my edges, so I kind of sleep like this. Eh, it's not not that bad, but you gotta make sure that you let your hair dry, let the curls, um, let the the hair that's wet, let it air dry before you go to sleep because you don't want to go to sleep on wet hair. It's not pretty. Mm -mm. Nope, not at all. Alright YouTube, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up, maybe two. <laughs> um, let me know if you liked it. Leave your comments below. Um, let me know if you want to see more uh, tutorials, more hair tutorials. I said before how I have um, my Instagram page, Instagram slash um, be love shy at Instagram. And I have, I think about 18 hairstyles, one, eight hairstyles, 18 hairstyles. Let me know what hairstyles you see on that Instagram page that you want me to do a tutorial for. Um, yeah, so let me know. All right, I'll talk to y'all later. Like, comment, subscribe, comment some more. All right, I like to read your comments and you know, to hear your feedback. 
Alright, I appreciate my new subscribers and keep locking up. <laughs> yeah, be blessed. Take care. Bye.